Greetings, this is the Timeshare Traveler. Today I'm reviewing the Worldmark Kapa'a Shore, the one bedroom in Kapa'a, Kauai, in the state of Hawaii. Um, it's a, right on the ocean, beautiful views. Um, there is no air conditioning, but you really don't need it because you get the uh, trade winds blowing right through the room, and it was a wonderful fact. I slept in the living room instead of the bedroom so I could hear the waves at night. So before I get into the details about the room and the various things, I want to tell you a little bit about my channel, and then I'll dive right in. Hi, my name is Cliff and I'm the Timeshare Traveler. The purpose of this channel is to provide education and knowledge for those interested in timeshares. I've been a timeshare owner for over 15 years. I'm an elite owner with Marriott Vacation Club, Hilton Grand Vacations, and Worldmark by Wyndham. I've also posted over 70 timeshare video reviews of different locations, and I've posted 40 timeshare video tips. Uh, please don't forget to hit the uh, subscribe button below and I can be found at Timeshare Trav on Twitter and Facebook and my website is www.timesharetraveler.com. Hi, this is the um, Kapa'a Shore, uh, one bedroom in Kapa'a, Kauai, in the state of Hawaii. This is a view as you walk in, you see the long hallway here and then the first door to your right you have, I believe it's a, king, a queen size bed, two nightstands, the clock, and a small TV. Should note, ceiling fan for keeping you cool. And then that's the bedroom. And the next room is the bathroom. And here you have a single sink. And you have the tub shower combination and the toilet. Okay, now heading toward the living room. You have a nice, some additional storage here, but you also have some in the bedroom. The table for two, right here. And a nice island for cooking, a dishwasher, coffee maker, nice set. And I put the one pan out that I use a lot for cooking with eggs. You have a full oven and microwave. Um, I should note also, if you're a person who likes to do cooking in the oven, you have plenty of uh, capabilities for that here, which I really like. Um, you have a microwave and then the freezer Refrigerator combinations, good size. And then moving into the living room, you have the couch, chair, and it's got two more ch chairs so that you can sort of um, sit and talk to the person while the food is being cooked. And there's a small TV right here in the corner. And of course, wouldn't be anything without a ceiling fan. And lastly, it's the Murphy bed. And again, it just pulls out and you don't, oops, um, you sort of bring it down and the legs open up automatically and there you have it. What I like about this layout is it opens up without me having to move any of the living room furniture and so it's a nice layout. Um, that way you comfortably sleep for and it's a nice mattress as most of the uh, world mark how most of the beds are. And again, I'm just lifting it up with one hand so you can see that it's not that hard. Okay, I'm in room 114. Hopefully this will open easy. Oop, I need to pull the thing out of here so I can get it open. But it's, I'm on the ground floor. So you look out onto a nice table to have coffee. A couple extra chairs so you can four people. And then, most importantly, the view of the pool and the ocean out there. Might as well zoom in on the ocean since that's why you come to Hawaii. And you have a good view of the ocean. Hope you enjoyed the review at Kapa'a Shore, one bedroom in Kapa'a the island of Hawaii in the state of Hawaii. 
I ended up sleeping in the uh, living room because I wanted to hear the sounds of the ocean and actually you're close enough where you can do that. So I'm going to be quiet for just a second so you can hear um, the sounds of the ocean. Hope that was enough and hope you could, uh, came through on the video, but it was uh, really nice falling asleep um, to the ocean here at the um, Kapa'a shore in Kapa'a, Kauai, Hawaii. Here's the sunrise right on the porch. You can also hear the waves near the Kapa'a shore in Kauai, uh, Kapa'a city in the island Kauai, in the state of Hawaii. Beautiful the way the sun is coming out from behind the uh, clouds there. Here's the uh, hot tub at the World Mark Kapa, and the pool is also here. It's a pretty open pool, fairly small, but it's nice and square, so a lot of people um, in it, and it's perfect for kids. And plenty of places to sit, but more importantly, the big pool, or jokingly, the ocean, and there are plenty of places you can sit along the other half, around chairs, which is where more people tend to sit than a lot around the pool unless they're uh, uh, with their kids in the swimming pool. Girls at the World Mark Kapa'a Shore in uh, Kapa'a Makawai. And you know, they've got nice uh, big thick grills. And they're really easy to do. You just have to turn the knobs and hit the light button, which is right here. There's no need to tip the timer on or anything like that. Um, and they have four of them here all together. So I've not had any trouble getting in to use one. Here's the uh, shared laundry room at the Worldmark Kapa. There are three washers and three dryers, and they uh, look to be coin operated. So you probably have to go to the uh, front desk to change. But if you have it, you can do it's a shared laundry here at the Worldmark Kapa. We also have a shuffleboard here at the Kapa'a shore, and you can see people lying looking out at the ocean. This is how close you are um, to the ocean. And that long view, and all the way down. Cost to stay at the World Mark Kapa'a is 10,000 points, which is about $860, which translates into about $130 per night. Not bad for an oceanfront uh, timeshare on the island of Kauai in the state of Hawaii.